just been digging out blackcurrant bushes. I've dug four out, and people down here a lot of them want them. So I'm just going to leave one here, because they, uh, they're a bit too close together. So leave one to let it get quite big. That'd be nice. Glorious morning though. Really bright sun. Lots of solar power being generated. This is what we want. Free electric and I've got the deer um, rack chest area in the oven. Uh, cooking it all up. It's, um, my friend didn't decide what he wanted to do with it so I decided just to put it in the oven whilst the sun is shining. She's ready for the off. They always fruit on the um, previous year's growth, so if someone cuts them right down to the ground, they won't get any fruit. There's three into Damien's plot. There's not plenty more to get rid of. Just overwhelmed by blackcurrants. I don't particularly like blackcurrants. Most of this row it hit out here because um, this would be a nice sheltered spot for growing lettuces and things like that, because it would give the shelter from the polytunnel. That's the polytunnel's just there. Well, that's got four, no, five dug up. Four along the start here. Uh, so, nice gap. And then three at the back. I've taken the one out the middle, so I've thinned them out. And then that gives them a bit more space. I haven't got round to pruning the black currants yet, but I'll prune, prune them and I'll prune them into a nice shape. As I say, you don't want to prune black currants too far back, else you won't get any fruit. I think, um, I think I could probably tell which the fruiting buds are now, so that would help. I think the fruiting buds are the one near the um, near the stems, near the uh, like branches. So uh, I'll try and leave those get lots of fruit, not too much growth, but the shape is the main thing. You want to make them into a sort of chalice shape, open. Um, because if you want, if you want to keep them, that's a good idea to uh, net them, because the blackbirds love them. But uh, what I've found in the past is that you, they go, they go sort of red and then sort of blackish colour, um, but it's only when they, they sort of swell up that they're sweet. So don't pick blackcurrants too early, that's my advice. Um, but then again, as soon as they get sweet, the blackbird's going to eat them. So you need to put some nets over. But not nets that are going to harm the birdies. Right, bye for now.